those superstar minutes are earned. They're not given. And I think, you know, when RJ first got into the league, you know, he's coming out of one of the best programs in the country, kind of, you know, spoon fed him, silver platter guy. But you got to earn those superstar minutes. They're yep. just not something that you can get just because you come from a certain pedigree. You come uh, from a certain program. And but, right now, he's not earning them. But who right are you, now, who are you giving those minutes? So you're going to give it a, the, you're gonna give it a Theo Pinson? Listen, we, that's we the other issue. <laughs> that, no, we got, we got shooters here. We got people who can make a bucket. Who? But who? That, exactly. He's in a walking that, boot. Alec Burks is hurt. Yeah. Austin Rivers is still here, CP. Rivers was on the court. He started tonight, J. Ellis. <laughs> tonight might be a little bit different because we're shorthanded. But last night and a few games ago, when when my man is going 0 for 22 from 3, yeah. it's like, dog, He's I get it. second best option. Where else are you going? You're going exactly. to take Harper off the bench? CP, I'm not. Listen, I'm not. CP, I'm not saying play him five minutes a game. I'm saying take him down from 38 to like <laughs> – 28. No. The thing is, it's 30. Not, the thing is, it's not an issue of obviously limiting his minutes would be the thing you would do if you had somebody to replace him with. Now yeah. you can say put Knox in, you can say a bunch of other people, but the thing is, is how sustainable is that? Like how often can you actually do that? That's the issue. We don't necessarily have enough shooters. And yes, RJ is not shooting great, but he is our second option. You know what I mean? So it is, it kind of leaves you at a standstill, what you want to do for the development of the team and the development of RJ as a player, let's be honest, if you can limit his minutes, it takes the pressure off of him, maybe gives him time to really develop, slowly get back into things. But on the other side of that, who are you going to replace him with? Like, what, what, that, what's, the, what's the alternative? That's what is the like, alternative? What, I Listen, I, I hear what Ari's saying, right? Even last night in garbage time, I'm wondering why he's even out there trying to close the game when they have a back-to-back. -back. Like, back. I just didn't see, see the point in that. And then the second thing is, how does that impact the confidence, right? Is is too much minutes and, and struggling hurting the confidence? You put him on the bench, is that going to hurt his confidence? I think it's it's a tough balance. I think it's a tough balance when you're trying to manage um, the confidence and the, and the ego of your young draft pick who himself is in his head trying to figure out how to get things right. It's tough. Absolutely. I, I, RJ's a gamer, man. This guy, we talk about how this guy has such a tough mind. He's a greedy kid. He's come from this, come from that. We worry about cutting his minutes down from 38 to 33. He's going to cut his confidence. Like, I don't I don't, I don't get it, man. Like, we can cut no. it in five minutes. We can. You said, you said cutting it from 38 to, like, 25 or something cut like it. that. Cut it. I didn't say 25. I said 28. <laughs> okay. So, the thing is, is 28, 30. <laughs> He is right, though. You run the risk of what does that do to his confidence? You know, you look at it happens. It happens all the time in sports. You look at yeah. football, for example. What does it do? Look at Tua with the Miami Dolphins. What happens every time he has a bad game? They bench him yeah, they, they and they bring in Fitzpatrick. So what does that do to a quarterback or a young player in general, bringing it back to basketball? What does that do to, do to their confidence? It makes them walk on eggshells. It I... makes them think that every time they make a mistake, they're either going to be benched or their limits are going to be cut. So, yes, that may not happen with RJ. But you run the risk that it is a possibility. But there comes a time where you have to stop coddling somebody who I think has been coddled most of his basketball playing career and kind of give him the harsh reality. Like, you want to be a superstar. You want to be the face of this franchise. You have to earn these minutes. They're not going to be given to you. And right now, you're not earning them. When you do, you'll get them back. So it depends on like how kids want to handle it. I, I like that part of what you said. Like, that part. Like, earn your minutes. He just has to play better, man. He just has to play, play better. better. He yeah. just got to play better. Man, he's 19. She's sitting down five Five, five to ten extra minutes a game ain't gonna hurt you. you. You're leading the league in minutes. You're leading the league in minutes. <laughs> yeah, that is a little. And you complain about it's a little about OD. It's, it's a little OD, but <laughs> I don't know, man. Uh, I don't know what this guy tips. He feels like you know they asked him again, and and he he gave the same answer he gave in the off season how he manages minutes. He says, oh, you know, it kind of evens out over time. There's ways to pace guys, whether it's not practicing or. Um, you know, throttling down the minutes as the season yeah. progresses. Tibbs feel. feels like he has the answers. Let's see how it impacts RJ over the course of the season. Just, We're only at if, game 11. Go ahead. If my man, if my man is, is losing confidence for playing 30 minutes a game, then we got the wrong guy. 
Yeah, if you maybe if you started at 30 minutes a game, but you're taking him from one part, so you're giving him superstar minutes, and you're obviously cutting him down. He's not like an idiot. Nah. He knows it's because he's not playing well. You're reducing his minutes. <laughs> you're, it you're, cuts your confidence. You're you're, you're, not, re- <laughs> but you're reducing. You're not minutes. reducing. You're not reducing his minutes because you just want him, you know, to rest and and take it easy. You're reducing his minutes because he's not playing well. Like he's not dumb. Like he knows. From the most minutes in the league to. A regular all-star-ish rotation player is not going to hurt his confidence. Knox is out here playing 15 to 20 minutes a game. He will be fine. We'll see. Okay. We'll, we'll see, man. You want to take that gamble? Go ahead. <laughs> That's, what That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You take that gamble. Let me know how it works.